and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too. And uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific and crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. This is certainly one of the more modern, more high-tech arenas around Europe. It is the Belton's Arena. Germany have chosen to go 4-3-3. Three, three. Jim, how do you see it? Yeah, Peter, you can look at this formation movement and think that it is 4-3-3, three, three, and the next time you check, it'll be 4-5-1. And it's all to do with whether you've got the ball or not, and the wider attacking players being asked to apply defensive discipline too. When it does turn to a five across midfield, then the shape of this team takes on a much tidier, compact defensive look. What about that, Jim Beglin? It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded for penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. As soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. They can win style! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Oh, that always looked the likely outcome. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set it free in the box. Got it in dramatic fashion. A massive test of character, and they passed it with flying colours. A truly outstanding comeback by any measure. Your final thoughts, Jim? Germany simply made their superiority count. They found cruise control quite early and, and didn't need to go to turbo. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.
Water!